Hello, um, I'm teacher Tom. Tom, nice to meet you. How are you today? I'm good. Thank you. And you? I'm good too. Thank you. Today we're going to talk about holidays and festivals. Um, are you ready? Yes, of course. I'm ready. Okay. So, now please introduce yourself first. My name is Ni. I'm 11 years old. My birthday is on 17 of May 2010. I live in Hadong District, I'm a city with my family. I'm Vietnamese. Okay. Um, can you tell me where did you go for your last holiday? Last summer, my family and I went for a holiday in Nha Trang. To me, traveling with family can be one of the most amazing memories we can have together. I really love the moments when we had meals together and took part in different outdoor activities. Mm -hmm. Okay, what do you do on holidays? I often do something sporty. I love riding around the town, going for work, or playing my favorite sport. Any for these activities are good ways to get healthy. Okay, great. Uh, can you name some of popular festivals in your country? Yes, there are Vietnamese New Year, Mid Autumn Festival, or Lantern Festival. Okay, which one is your favorite? The Lunar New Year would be my favorite festival. It's a time for family. Reunions, as people who were far away from home can spend time with their loved ones after a long year. Mm, sweet. What special food do you have for a Tet holiday? Mm, Vietnamese people often prepare very traditional food for each meal. If you ask anybody in Vietnam, Quick food comes to their minds first when talking about tea. I'm sure that the answer is chung cake. And another classic dish is Vietnamese sausage. Interesting. Um, how do you celebrate festivals in your country? I celebrate each festival in a different way. For example, during Tet holiday, my family will cook delicious dishes, but something that all my festival celebrations have in common and that in, is that I always try to spend as much time as I can with my family and close friends. I do believe this is how most Vietnamese celebrate festival as well. Mm -hmm. Nice. What special food and activities do you have for these festivals? If we talk about the Mid-Autumn Festival, five fruits, trays, and moon cakes would be the common traditional dishes. During this festival, we have trained to walk line dance and carry lanterns in different shapes. There are different activities and species food to different festivals. Mm -hmm. Okay, thanks for sharing again. It was nice to spend time with you today. Thank you and goodbye. I'm happy to talk with you. Thank you so much. Thank you too.